Okay, this is Lily, and I'm talking with two incredible Iranians, and as you say, Iranians. <laughs> <laughs> Mosi, who I know, and please introduce yourself and your fight name. Me now? Yeah. <clears throat> My fight name is Vaitushin. Vaitushin. You can't. You can't he doesn't call me know what that is. Main douchebag. Anyway, <laughs> you can call me Russiani. You were together in Iran for six years. You said. No, we were we were together in Iran six years. We were in Iranian my own team for six years. We fighting in the same flag and in the same team. Yeah. Yeah. We were together in the six all, years. You know, always we train. <laughs> yeah. Listen. Okay. We always train together, and everybody jealous us. You know. Why they are they are together? They say it as twins, twins, twin? twins. Yeah, twins. twins. Yeah. And uh, always uh, I remind that memory. And now I'm with him. Really, he's my best friend forever. Really, and uh, I like him. I like him so much. He helped me every time. My fights, in every, everything I need, he, he helped as a good friend. Mosi, I, I know you're wincing. <laughs> I know you're wincing, but but, I, I, but really, I, I, it's I, the brotherhood, right? It's together. brotherhood, yeah. Yeah, I know. You know, I know how this feel exactly. Yeah. You know why? Because when you, because we didn't meet, see each other for like a few years now, like since I left Iran, and then that since last time I met him in Thailand, it was probably 2010. So since that time, I mean, like we were very close together. It was 2011, yeah. We were too, we were very close. I mean, that close, it would be like we trained together like all the time. Like I had, I had no other partner in the team. Like you know, he was my best partner. I could train and share my training with him, and I did enjoy my every minutes of the training I had with him. And any competitions we go, we used to share in the room because. It was about the mental friendship, you know. Yeah. When you mentally very close to someone, that person could handle everything. He, he was reading my mind and I was reading his mind. What I need, he gave to me. What he need, I give it to him. In a fight, in a training, during a time we were, like, you know, it was just like amazing friendship we had together. I know it sounds a little bit weird. No, it doesn't. But, but you know, in a... In a team, we were together. It was an amazing team. We had amazing times. We went to the, so many different competitions since 2005, like a Princess Cup, Asian Indoor Games, two wise together, and like a World Championship in Thailand, in Korea, in Thailand again. And we, I went. He went to Japan for a fight. I went yeah. to Japan for a fight. We met each other in Japan. We had a fun together there. I mean. Yeah. I mean, it, it was just such an incredible time. Like, you know, I'm always looking forward again. We have a game. So could somehow you know, meet each see, other somewhere. You know? I was three, three kilograms overweight, okay? The morning when I wake, wake up, I get wrong. And after that, two kilograms, uh, I should, more two kilograms need to lose. I told to my, myself, because I didn't have phone and I had, didn't have internet, I couldn't uh, connect to Muslim. I told to myself, oh my god, Mosi, where are you? <laughs> we'll be here, I can't, I can't lose my weight. Suddenly called me to my room in hotel. Wait, where are you? I'm here, I need to you. He said, okay, come on to my gym. And really, I, really, really, I lose my weight so, so easy because he was with, with me. You understand? Yeah. You so know what was the funny thing? <laughs> it was the funny thing. I called him from my phone and then he, and then I connect to the room, like, a, uh, hotel here and they connect me to his room and then I said hey wait how are you doing it's Mosi oh you downstairs come here upstairs I said no I'm, I'm not in the hotel I'm at the work I, I couldn't leave work otherwise I, w I would come in <laughs> yeah but you know and then so he, I just you know I just asked him to come me over like you know just did some workout just you know a little bit sweating out 
you know, I was teaching the class, but in the same time I was coming yeah. to him, you know, I had my personal training also with other guy, I was talking to him, you know. So he can he can understand me, you know. So it was it is amazing to I, I see him again here, you know. He <laughs> he's my best friend I could have. That's all I say. And you were you you told me you were the captain of the Iranian team. Yeah. Okay, so tell me a little bit about that and how it transferred over. Uh, I said since 2005, uh, we, we both we, we both in the same competition. It was the Iranian national team. Uh, it was first for the Yeah, team. first first Iranian national team election. I mean, like a, a competition, you can come to the like the Iranian national team, what they call it in English. Uh, the the competitions they choose the fighters. Election. For Iranian Country team. election. No. I couldn't say country election. Country election is just for what, president. President, yeah, but it was a Iranian national team competition. Okay. They choose the fighters for Iranian national team, right? It was a, for Muay Thai national team. But okay. anyway, we have been in Iranian national team since first day we, we went together, 2005, and then we went for the competitions few times. And 2006 uh, and 2007, 2008, I said so many times. So during that time, like. In 2006, I was, I think. Fine. So they, in uh, Iranian national team, they, they, yeah, they, they try to like find it like the captain to want to, like have a leader, like a, you know, make the guys connect together, being a like a team, you know. Yeah. Because I'm a quite team person. I love, I love, I love to be, you know, everyone's friends together, work as a Bye -bye team together, you know. <laughs> So they they, they picked me. So, so I don't know why. <laughs> they picked me. Maybe it was, was a, right. the kind of the leadership I could manage to just fix everyone yeah. together. Why is it right? Why is it right? Why? Why is it? Right? Why? Why, is it why is because his 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 behavior more than me. You know? He love everybody. He like everybody. But I have not seen like him. You know, when I when I like him, I like him just like him. Maybe two or three person. I cannot like. Everybody. You know what he's talking help. about? He's talking about that when you be in a team, yeah. you couldn't dislike yeah. someone when you are the captain, fair. you know. Yeah. Yeah, so I was, I, was, I, was, I was quite a fair person. Even sometimes I didn't like someone, but I was nice to them because, you know, you couldn't be a, like a nasty captain, you know. Okay, you but, but then you became the next captain. Yeah. So did he teach you or yeah, did you because, just like learn? Because, you know, when <laughs> Or not learn. Iran, <laughs> and most is leave Iran. I, I still fight for national team. And, uh, for my my behavior, first they don't choose me for for captain, and, and choose other one that maybe two, two or three years he, he came to national team. And I don't say nothing because I I did know that I'm not good boy. Not, I'm not behavior, you know. <laughs> but after that, uh, after that, suddenly I was uh, head coach. He said, buy this captain because he has more medals, he's many years in national team, he is captain. I said, okay, this time. <laughs> Did you feel pressure? I was, yeah, I was better. Okay. I, I, you, you feel know, pressure? When, yeah, for when, when they chose me, chose me, I'd be better. Okay. Yeah. Good boy? Yeah, not good boy. He did not, he the pressure, <laughs> for sure, to the Shafi Cup, actually. Yeah, he had the pressure so because he's yeah. the captain there, so he needs yeah, to like, okay, make okay, it Okay, I like you, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, it's, it's all about the times and it's about the memories. You know, this time's gonna go quick, you know. So times fly, you know. Yeah, so. tell, me, tell me a little bit about um, some of the fights that you both been together like in Japan and some of the memorable fights that you've had or been in other corner like together in Japan or, or Thailand first I want to I want to I want to talk about this fight you know he was top fighter in Iran you know every, everybody come to him really cannot fight against him you know because by punch by by Pepsi Cola but in, in uh, Olympia the Iranian oh. Uh, suddenly, in, in, suddenly, you know, he was not good at fight, and maybe, maybe his opponent beat him. I see. I was fired too. Okay, I was ready. I was, I was ready for fight too. But suddenly, I saw, oh my God, Moses is not good in this fight. You know, I run, go to uh, his coach, tell him, hey, Mosi, 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 we. But you know, it's it's uh, it's a memory, a memory that I cannot forget it. 
not because me, just you know, he know me, I understand he, me understand me, and I know that's, he's that's taking. Just I tell him, okay, do yeah, yeah. Mental and friend. He, he did, me. and he, he won his fight. That's very important actually. I was yeah. talking to the other guy in the gym today. I said, actually, we're talking about Busi. So, okay, when you want training for a fight and get ready for a fight, it's not just about the physical training. You get in physically ready and just going for a fight. Yeah. You need to be mentally ready and mentally prepared exactly the way you physically get in ready for a fight. Some fighters, they are in incredible shape, they are amazing, like uh, they're training hard. But mentally, they lose already the fight. So it's about that, that mental things, that connection I had with Vahi. So that's what he trying to say. That competition, the fight was going very like a close. So and I was quite struggling. I remember that that was in the final. So even he was he was supposed to fight the next fight after me in a, like the, his final. He, he he ran to the corner and then he was talking to my corner and say hey tell do this because he knows what I should to do and he knows my style and what's my best performance and could be you know so he was talking about that and then he he said like how how was helpful that time for me you know exactly yeah I felt it that day yeah we had so many times together we went for it like that. Indoor Asian game 2005 in Thailand, which he got a gold, he got a silver medal there. 2007 also in Macau, it was an Asian indoor game again. I got a gold medal. He, he got the silver medal. You know. <laughs> All right, we had to switch places because we had too many people yelling at us, around us. <laughs> Have you ever, you guys ever been in Japan together? Yeah. I even for competitions in Japan. For, uh, K1 Max, yeah? Yeah. And then during the time, one of the other promoters like, matched me with the other Japanese guys, so I flew out to Japan also. Yeah. So we were catching up the guys there, you know. Sometimes I went to his gym to training, sometimes he came to other K Came a corner again. So. A good feel again. Yeah. In many places, Korea. Uh, Thailand many times. Yeah. HK, Macau, many countries. He's feeling good. And um, he's saying like he had a very good training, very good game plan for this fight. Because he had a fight already with Lonsai, which is he won the fight. And he, he won that fight. It was back in the time in 2007, which was actually the competition. Actually, I lose. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I, I but, actually you know, I lose. It's, it's not about the close fight, but I, I think I lose. Decision? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. decisions, split decisions. You know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That was close, but I think he was more. But uh, <laughs> it's my chance. But anyway, I'm talking about the time he knows Nonsai style, and I used to train in the same gym as Nonsai for a long time in Suchi Plaza, yeah. in uh, Vindia Sport, in like a Muita Plaza. Oh, yeah. He always was my coach. Spar together, me and Nonsai. Yeah. Spar so together. This 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 fight couldn't be like a hard hard match, you know, for Bahi because Bahi knows the style. Anyway, Nonsai knows like the style too, you know. Persian warriors. Yeah, you know, Persians always around, which is you have a simple here. Yeah. Is a Persian simple for the Iranian religious, which was before Islam. We saying good thought, good words, and good deeds. Nice. And it's saying like it was a simple for Iranian religious before Islam. So many Iranians still believe that. Which I believe I'm a Muslim guy, but I believe that you know, which I I, I care about my country a lot. So. We are Persian and we always gonna put up our countries and we, we love always, Iran. You know, we love Iran. Wherever we go, we are Iranian, it doesn't matter. I'm, I live in Hong Kong, he, he lives in Japan for a while, he lives wherever we are, we are Persian, we're fighting for the flag. Yeah. That's all we care, you know. So thanks for your time. And one more thing. Also oh, yeah, uh, uh, also this is something very different from you guys. What? Is the uh, the Olympic decision to include wrestling in in the Olympics okay this is like a huge thing because Iran and and so many other countries have come together and we have so many iconic memories of yeah. people from different countries competing together especially from different ideologies how do you how do you feel about this decision honestly 
that night I was awake till like at 12 in the night because the, the conference was in Argentina and it yeah. was like a time missing. I was awake till like 11:30, 12. Which when when the BBC website put on wrestling series in Olympic, I was jumping up because like wrestling in Iran is huge. It's like a, the last no. Olympic, you know. Yes. No. The last Olympic, the, the Iran's got like a three gold medal. Yeah. One one silver medal, two like a bronze medal. It's, it's a kind of the sport the Iranians like grew up. It's like a Muay Thai in Thailand. Since the young age, my dad taught me the wrestling coach. You know, so e why everyone. Everyone in Iran now wrestling, you know. They know when, how to when, wrestle. when somebody fighting together, don't shot punch. They get <laughs> like this. Really? You know? Yeah. <laughs> Iran, Iranian loves wrestling, and everybody know. And in, in our blood, you know. Yeah. So it was a huge, huge thing. Actually, you know, it was something they took us from us. They just give it back to us again. So it doesn't, you know, yeah. Yeah. like come on, wrestling is like a history for like a years and sport. years you know so it's yeah. like a, they want to take a weightlifting out from olympic is that possible yeah. no because it's kind of the people's enjoying to watch yeah. like a, you know athlete like a, can you say like everyone's going to watch him like in both like he's the fastest man in the world so everyone's going to watch him like in the wrestling too you know yeah. when the russians guy they match with the iranian guy the iranian guy match with the american yeah. guy it's like you know it's like everyone wants to watch like whole who's world beat who? yeah. of course so I'm very happy, you know, when I hear that. And it's sports, right? So it's sports. So it's not it's not a life or death battle. And you shake hands after. Of course. Yeah. That's a friendship. Yeah. That's a friendship. People which is in Muay Thai is big, you know. You know, politi politics is not like us. We are, you know, how I can explain it. Anyway, politics is... Politics. Anyway, don't worry about yeah. politics. Politics is not important for me. Just friend, friend, friendship is better more than everything. I will do. I will do my best. You know, you know, fight is different with train. Maybe yes. you, you train very good, but uh, during fight, not good. But I will do my best. Moses is with me. And I think I will. I will talking be good. about the uh, training hard and make the fight and whatever. <laughs> You're gonna go do the, your job, which is you're gonna just win. If you're talking too much, I'm gonna elbow you in the face. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Fight is fight. I know you train hard, and you're gonna, you're gonna fight easy tomorrow, actually. That's what we call it saying to him. He said, train hard, fight easy. You know, no, no. I mean, it's no, no, no. It's this not like that. It is, I will fight good tomorrow. Dude, don't be, don't be like too emotional here for me. Yeah, you know, because the Iranians are all emotional, you know, I'm an emotional person, but I live really? like for a few years outside Iran, which makes me a little bit calm down, but still I'm an emotional person, honestly. <laughs> so, you know, so it's all good, it's all good. But unfortunately, he's gonna leave very quick after his fight, like two days, it's because the Hong Kong government are like strict, crazy yeah. and strict about the, like, the visa, come on, yeah. just they gave him five day visa, which is like... Uh, I don't really understand. Anyway. It's okay. They're but afraid you're gonna take all the women. Maybe. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, I really? don't think about it. <laughs> no, hey. I don't think about it. Really. Thanks for your time, Lily. Thank you, guys. It was, it was great having you here, you know. And looking forward to the next interview with you. Two Persian warriors. Us. Us.